yes. I'm in that mood, mommy. Oh my goodness. Are you guys in the mood? Yes, we are. <laughs> yes, another workout for you. A new one. As usual, we've got to warm it up using the music that Mary Patterson and her mom like. It's your classical music. Here we go, up and down. Da da da. Makes you want to ride a horse, this one, doesn't it? <laughs> Here we go. I'm using dumbbells. You don't have to if you don't want to. You can do this from your chair. Ha! Here we go. Okay, so that's a hammer curl we're doing there. Now with a upright row here. That's good. Now push up to the ceiling up here. Bicep, ordinary biceps. Here we go. Uh -huh. Yes, here we go. Uh -huh. Now, lots of repetitions on these because what we're doing is we are putting stamina into those muscles. Here we go. Good. Single arm over the head, right hand, left hand, right, left. Right, left, right, left. Up and down like so. As you come up, squeeze your butt together. Oh, your butt cheeks. I think we need to pump that music a little bit more, don't you? That's a bit low, isn't it? Yeah. It's a bit of a low It is, isn't it? Here we go, and hop. Back to biceps. Changes to hammer curl. Bring it in front. Then we're going to keep the palms facing each other. Push up and down like so. Uh -huh. Turn the palms around. Up like so. Change this to single hand. You go right, left, right. Left, right, left. That's good. Back to biceps. Ordinary biceps here. Tuck your elbows into the side. That's good. Now we change this to a hammer curl. <coughs> I feel a thought coming on, mommy. Oh, no. Hey, keep the palms facing each other. Push up. You want to hear the thought? Yes, it's a Okay. Always remember that there's some people out there who set their watches by your clock. Here we go. Push up, palms facing me. <laughs> that means don't be late. Okay. Be on time. Here we go. Okay, this good. Hands down. Legs wider. Now this time, reach down for the heel. Down. Hup. 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 Working the legs. Inside time. Point your toes into the corner of the room. Oh yes, a lot of squatting here. Oh yeah. Turning up those legs. Okay, good. Up and back. You're looking different today. Yes. Kind of black and greyish. Yes. Is that hiding a multitude of sins? No. No? You sure? Did I have too much to eat last night? No. No? Too much breakfast? You haven't had it yet? Okay. You're a bit late having it. I mean, here we are, it's midday. I know. But you haven't had it yet. Yep. Here we go. Okay, now I'm going to put the same sequence together with the arms. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay. I'm going to start with the biceps, ready? Here we go. Go! So the palms are facing up to the ceiling, elbows tucked in. Changes to a hammer curl. That's good. Keep marching. Again, you can sit in the chair and do this. Push up to the ceiling. Palms facing each other. Palms facing me. Squeeze your shoulder blades together. We're going to add one, one more onto this. Here we go. Push forward. Chest press. Actually, we'll add two more onto it. Okay. We're gonna cross it in front. Ha! So if you do this with cans or dumbbells, you're probably gonna find it pretty tough going. Hands down, march it up. Ha! Gonna do all those 
exercises together. Are you ready for it? Can you remember it? Nope. You can't I'm remember it. You, you following me? Yeah. Ah, I might get you lost. I do love this. It always brings back memories of the. I know. I'm going to say it. <laughs> yes. That young man on his bike riding up the hills in Yorkshire. Here we go, biceps. Ordinary. I went to town with Mam and me. We had a real bite of fatigue. Here we go. I'm a curl. I remember it. But I only remember it because my granddad told me about it. Yes. I don't know what's next. Cross in front. Okay, really good. Okay, so today what we're going to do is we're going to do a few things. Do some lunges. Don't go down too low. Yeah. Right? You can always use a chair if you need to. Alright, so I'm going to do it from the side so you can see exactly what the action is. And we're going to use the dumbbells at the same time. Okay. Alright, you're trying to work out which way to do it, don't you? Yes. Okay, there you go, alright. Okay, so we're on the side. Let's go forward. Lunge, take it back, change legs. Now, the lower you put that back leg, the more work you're doing on the uh, muscles in your legs, alright? So, that back knee wants to go down towards the floor, stay as upright as you can, alright? And don't forget, do it with a smile on your face, yes? Lower you go down with the back leg. If you're losing your balance, you can take your legs slightly apart. Now, we're going to stay on the same leg in a moment. Next time, on your right leg, eight times. Eight, and give me right leg. As you come back, you really kind of drag the leg back. So you go forward, drag back. Squeeze the butt together here. I want to do eight from now. Eight, good. Looking very angelic. The sun has really caught your face. It makes you look, you're kind of glowing, radiant. Yes. Two. One. Other leg. Here we go for eight. Well, actually, it's going to be 12. Thank you. Very good. Yes. And with the weight, you can go. Yes. Seven. Want to do eight more? No, we don't. Want to do four. Yes. Thank you. Good. And one. Okay, now we're going to work further down the legs. I'm just going to pull this back a bit. I want you standing that end facing the wall. Alright? So, what you're going to do, legs are shoulder width apart. Okay, you're going to push up on the ball of the foot, up and down, up and down. Now, you notice as you contract, the calf muscles work. That's really important. Go up. Weight in your hand, no matter how small it is, you're overloading those muscles. Yeah, now if you want to improve your balance, you want to try and do this without holding on. That's good, pushing up and down. Yes, and as we get older, the one thing that happens, we tend to lose our balance a bit, and that's all to do with the muscles loosening up in certain areas, right? So that creates an imbalance. But we can correct it by doing things like this. Now, you want to do one leg, keep looking straight ahead. You may want to hold on to something, just a finger. In fact, just resting for balance. Okay, lift up, your left leg, lift it up. Hold it there. Okay, now from that position, right, from that position, take your hands away, but keep looking straight ahead. Hold as much as you can, right? And that's just there to check your balance. This is improving your balance. It's also good for just basically tightening up the muscles, right, to hold it there nice and safe. Let's change the other leg. Okay, so looking straight ahead. Here we go, lift up the other leg, hold it there. Good, check your balance. You may want to put your hands out if you wish. But have one of it is nearby so you can check your balance on it. Very good, you're doing well. Now the progression for this is, guess what it is? You've then got to close one eye. <laughs> one eye closed, don't cheat. Hold it there. Okay, good, coming back, here we go. Right, these are real good for chest testing your balance. The other thing to do, and you want to do this as often as you can, is to put one leg in front of the other, right? Now you may need to again hold on to something, so 
one leg in front and you walk forward from that position, putting one heel to the toe as you walk along. And then you do it backwards. Alright? And it's worth trying that. Okay, good. This time we want to work inside thigh. But we're going to combine two exercises. Start with your left leg. You sweep it across the body. Okay, lift up for eight. Three, four, five, six, seven. Hold it up there for eight, right? Hold it there. Now, that knee wants to come up to the shoulder, right from there. You're going to go eight, seven, six, five. Oh my goodness. I can feel it. Two. Go eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Hold it up there, hold it up there. Working inside thigh. You're gonna bring that knee now up to your shoulder. I'm gonna load below that muscle. Go eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Last eight. Go eight, seven, six, five, four. Apart. Oh, that was really good. All right, so let's just do a quick stretch. The music's run out, it doesn't matter. We'll do it without the music. All right, bend both legs, extend your left leg out in front. Feel that stretch. So we'll do this without the music. Here we go, just hold it there. Feel that stretch. Reach down for the toes. You can come up onto the heel if you like by stretching out your hamstring muscle. If you guys are into sports, anything like football this is a very important stretch to do you want your hamstring muscle as long as possible and that means if you do it like this it's a great way to actually elongate that muscle drop the head down curl up come up to the top let's try the other side okay so you push it out like so hold it there bring the body and head down feel that stretch really good well done you should be proud of yourself let's hold that stretch it's really important that that's good hold it there yes drop the head down curl up come off the top just got to quickly do one more and that is you got to do the front of the thighs so i'm going to lean on you for balance you can hold on over there you bring the heel up and right, into your butt all right good there you go i'll have to do mine sitting down oh really yes. oh okay sit down then all right go on then so you bring it in, bring it into your butt, you're almost done. Then we've got to do the other side, all right? And that's how you do it in the chair. You sit towards the edge of the chair, the front of the chair, and literally slide that leg back as far as you can, all right? That's real good. Okay, let's quickly do the other side. Okay, bring it up and bring the heel into your butt. Don't tip forward, stay as upright as you can. Bring your heel up to your butt as further as you can. So that's where you're stretching the front of the thighs, and you just hold it there. Listen, gang. Thank you so much for joining me and Miss P. Right, it's been really good. I appreciate you being here. Have a real good day. Say yeah. Yeah.